Hey guys, I'm gonna get my answer right here. Back on this Madden 22 Giants franchise, and it is time. It's Super Bowl time, and it's the battle for MetLife, but it's not in MetLife. It's not even near MetLife. It's on the whole other side of the United States. We're in Vegas for this one. It's Giants Jets battle for MetLife in Vegas. Super Bowl. Is it 57, I think? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how the Jets got here with the 78 overall team, but uh, without further ado, oh yeah, let's take a look at the yearly awards before we get into this. Uh, Baker Mayfield won MVP with Daniel Jones in second, and uh, there are the rest of the uh, MVP candidates. Coach of the year, Joe Judge, because of the, you know, the 17-0 year. Um, we're only going to look at NFC, so Offensive Player of the Year ended up being Baker Mayfield. Marvin Mims came sixth, so we had two players there. Malik Willis, who I believe is his second season, he came eighth in that award uh, as Atlanta's QB. Defensive Player of the Year, we did get Stephon Gilmore up there in second, and that was it, uh, but... Khalil Mack ended up taking that. Offensive Rookie of the Year, it was Marvin Mims with Caleb Williams coming in second, and then Ben Knox in third from, from Washington, and then just some other nobodies. Uh, Sean Mason, who got benched, <laughs> ended up coming in eighth for the Eagles. Uh, defensive Rookie of the Year, Jimmy Parrish. Um, he, I, what is he? I don't know. It doesn't say what, what position he is, but uh, here's the rest of the uh, Defensive Rookie of the Year. Best QB, Baker Mayfield. Um, ben Knox made it his rookie season, so did Caleb Williams. Aaron Rodgers came second. Best running back, Christian McCaffrey. We were able to get Barkley up to fifth. Uh, James Conner, there's just a few of the other guys here. So, yeah, C-Mac won that. Best wide receiver was Marvin Mims, and then Stephon Diggs coming in second. Then Devontae Adams, Amari Cooper, Michael Thomas, Rayshon Phil... Blah, 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 blah. Chris Godwin, Kevin Ridley, Russell Gage Jr., and DK Metcalf. So, yeah, the top two were our players. Uh, best offensive lineman, uh, we had Jonah Williams, David DeCastro, and that was it. Uh, make it for us there. And best defensive lineman was Aaron Donald. I don't think we had anybody to finish the top ten for us here. Yeah, we didn't really perform too well in the defensive line. Best linebacker, I don't think we had anybody in here. But that ended up being Khalil Mack. Best defensive back, it was, it was Stephon Gilmore, by far, uh, dominated interception-wise. Then Jabril Peppers got second, and Xavier McKinney, who, I, that feels, I don't know, I feel like he didn't do too much this year. He ended up getting fourth. And uh, I'm thinking about maybe putting Xavier McKinney at corner for this next season, because uh, we're going to be getting rid of Harrison Smith and um, moving to Dory Jackson to um, safety, and that's going to... Uh, get rid of one of our corners. So, you know, we're probably going to move a safety or maybe a few safeties. Uh, and best kicker was Gabe Burke. It's just, just here, see if you see your favorite kicker. There's Austin Seibert. Um, all right, and then uh, with, with Baker Mayfield's MVP win, he does get an X Factor. So, yeah, without further ado, it's the battle for MetLife in Vegas. Giants, Jets, Super Bowl 57, I believe. Let's get started with this one. Once again, I'm going to say I have no idea how... We're playing the Jets in the Super Bowl because um, their stats weren't the best, you know. Um, their their starting running back, 58. Okay, their starting running back only had uh, five rushing touchdowns this season. <laughs> There's Zach Wilson though. Uh, the first game of the franchise, the Men 22 franchise, was the preseason game that we ended up winning against the Jets in the battle for MetLife. But, uh, this is the Super Bowl, so, you know, it's the battle for MetLife, but it's not in MetLife. It's New York versus New York, the, uh, the New Jersey, the East Rutherford, New Jersey teams, pretty much, taking on each other in Super Bowl 58, and, uh, it's gonna be exciting, because we're gonna win this game. Um, <laughs> Be Here we go, there's team, Baker, Jets, looking for his second the Super Bowl. Champions, the New York Giants. Gotta hype him up on the sideline, and there's Brand Zach Wilson, the uh, second overall season. pick it's been for our AFC in the 2021 NFL, NFL Draft. The there's Super Blake Bowl. Martinez. So we have to watch the presentation, because it's always special. I, um, I, I really like the Madden 25 Super Bowl presentation. Alright, here we go, the coin toss. You, can, you can never tell who wins this thing because both teams look equally happy. Um, 
NFC champions. They have gone through a lot to get where they See, are. See, like who won the toss? Looks it's scripted. All right, there's Let's Stephon Gilmore. I, yeah, one. I said I wasn't going to change the number until next season, but I was like, whatever, I'll just do it now. Julian Love. There's Gabe Burkich getting ready to send him on. Looks like we're going to be kicking Jamison Crowder. 23 returns, 571 yards, and zero touchdowns, and I think it was like 24.8 average. I don't know. I, I didn't really see it. 127 kickoffs, 114 touchbacks, and 22 points. Dang, man. 114 out of, what was it, 127 kickoffs were, have been touchbacks. All right, Gabe Burkich. To get a set in Super Bowl 58, it's the battle for MetLife in the Super Bowl. We are underway in the final game of the season. New York versus New York in the Super Bowl. Crowder's going to go ahead and take a knee, and that'll bring out the third-year man, Zach Wilson. Uh, he's 342, 573 on the year, 4,569 yards, 35 touchdowns, and 11 interceptions. You know, he could have a little more passing touchdowns. Um, you know, it's, it's a lot less than Baker uh, had this season. All right, here we go. The Super Bowl is underway, and uh, Zach Wilson's going to get it started. He has a superstar ability, and he's going to hand this one off. Um, they get three yards on that one. And uh, second and seven. Here's Wilson. Check it out. Put a player in motion. They're going to hand it off again. A big hit from Jabril Peppers, but Gaskin gets the first. And it's first and ten for the... Oh, hold on. Could be a long night defensively. No doubt about it, because when they are in sync, as we're seeing so far, where that continuity is there, and you can see that they're playing off of each other. guys. Melvin Gordon goes absolutely nowhere there. He loses it. He's Ojalari with the tackle. Um, and that'll make it second and 11 for the Jets. Wilson here with the snap. He's gonna hand it off to Melvin Gordon, who gets a better run there. Run of eight, or gain of eight. And it's third and three. Oh, they're probably gonna pass here. Okay, I'm, go I'm going man coverage. I can't make up my mind, but are you kidding me? They didn't even pass it. They lined it up exactly like they were going to pass it. Had I kept the blitz, man. Had I kept the blitz. Alright, and, uh... The Jets might, might be looking for... A score on the first drive here. It's looking positive for maybe a field goal. Zach Wilson's first throw of the game goes for eight yards. Joe Judge, he's got to get the offense ready. He's like, this could be the biggest game of your life. We need to prove... That we are the better New York team or New Jersey team, you know, same thing. Here's a snap. Wilson drops back and he's gonna go two for two. Big hit right there. It's Cole Beasley with the reception. Um, and I have who got the tackle? I wasn't even paying attention. I think it might have been Jabril Peppers. It was. He's got four tackles on this opening drive. This defense needs to uh, play a lot better. There's, uh, I think they'll credit Gilmore with the tackle, probably, on that. Could be wrong, of course, and we're not really going to be able to see it. No, yeah, never mind, we will. Uh, Gilmore did get the tackle! I saw Martinez, and I did think we had a shot at picking that off, but we didn't. I'm gonna get some guys, you know, I gotta get our safeties guarding the end zone here just in case uh, They've started passing the ball late in this drive jet sweep though and um, Are you kidding me? Okay, that that did not go well 19 yard run for Davis and uh, this defense, you know, I thought after looking at the team stats a 78 overall team versus a uh, a uh, what are we like an 87? I thought we would demolish the offense, but no, they uh they killed us. Uh, and the Jets get up in this one. Oh freak! All right, it's seven to nothing. New York, you know I think New York's gonna win this game, guys. 
But New York is kind of awesome. I think New York also has a good setup on this one, too. So Hunter Renfro is on for the return. His first appearance of this Super Bowl. Uh, and he'll get it to about, the, yeah, so the 27. And uh, Joe Judge, what's your problem? All right, Baker Mayfield is going to step on the field. His season stats, man, he dominated. 238 for 315, 5,335 yards, 66 touchdowns, and five interceptions. It's much better on the stat line than Zach Wilson this year. And, um, well, it's time to get our offense going in the Super Bowl. And, uh, we're gonna start it off with the zone fake jet with the run to Saquon here. And we're gonna hope the offense is able to show up. Baker Mayfield now has an X-Factor ability after his MVP. Uh, win and uh, that was just that wasn't really what we wanted there. Um, oh, Shep's out here. Wow, okay. I put him back down in the depth chart again. I put CD at the uh, wide receiver three and broke a tackle from Stefan Diggs. I'm not gonna try anything fancy, I'm just gonna try to uh, run for the first down, and we get that. First down, New York. Come on, take a snap. Let's go, Baker. All right, Saquon, we're having a little trouble so far. We got uh, five yards there. We could be running the ball a little better here, but, you know, we're not going to worry. Plenty of time still left in this thing to win. So, uh, we're just going to have to be patient with how we play in this one. And that's going to be caught by CeeDee Lamb, who will get it up to the 20-yard line. CeeDee Lamb, big gain in the Super Bowl. And uh, Baker now, we need consecutive passes for five yards in the air. To get the X-Factor, I'm going to go to Saquon, who's a running back, and that didn't really work out. Um, I probably should have thought that over a little more, knowing the fact that, you know, he's not a receiver, and, and that's not going to work like how it does with the receiver. I'm going for the secure catch, going to take it safe. We get a four-yard gain, and it's third and five, and, uh, we won't score, possibly, on the first drive. I mean, we still got time left, so I don't, I don't want to say that, but we could be down after the first drive. Oh, crap. Oh, I thought that was a horrible throw. I don't know how that works. Uh, here, hold on, guys. I'll be right back. <laughs> Sorry about that. Marvin Mims is going to score his first touchdown in the Super Bowl. Uh, in his first Super Bowl appearance. In his first drive in the Super Bowl. So, um, Marvin Mims. It's Baker to Mims to uh, get us on the board. And uh, if Burkich knocks this one down, it will be a tie game. And he will... 7-7 seven to seven. tie and the New York teams are even battle for New York I just decided we both wear the home jerseys I mean okay the Jets don't have their home jerseys on but technically they are their home like th their alternates that they would wear at home uh, Crowder's gonna take the knee in the end zone that's another touchback and uh, it's 7-7 seven to seven. Wilson's offense is gonna get the ball back here and uh, maybe they can find a way into the end zone again. Frick. <laughs> oh, that, okay. That wasn't a bad play. They might give the tackle to McKinney just because... I mean, they're showing McKinney, too. Uh, so... Just because he made the contact first. That's how Madden works. Alright, Wilson with the snap. We're through the line fast and we cannot sack him. Freaking Frick Frack, dude. Wilson's 4 for 4. Uh, I'm not liking how that's looking. And it's 3rd and 1 for the uh, the Jets. We'll see. Hopefully. I don't know. We're not looking too good if they run it here. I should have thought that through. Big hit though from Xavier McKinney. And uh, who could be playing quarter next year? We don't know. We still need to uh, uh, rearrange, you know, the... Um, the, the the order because you know Harrison Smith is gonna be off the team I just you know I haven't really been happy with how he's played like I don't think he's played horrible he's just like I don't think he's been great and I don't see us continuing with him on the team so I don't know who I'm gonna trade him for 
Uh, definitely not a draft pick. I have a lot of options at, um, in the draft, though. I'm looking at a lot of corners, a lot of defensive linemen, because we're also looking to replace Danny, Danny Shelton. And, uh, we might not even get rid of Shelton. We might just try to trade for a better defensive lineman, and then Shelton will be a backup. As I'm speaking bad about him, he made contact there. Um, but man, this, these, this, 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 I can't speak. This Jets offense right now, they're being a pain in the butt today. All right, here we go. Wilson with the snap. He's gonna throw to his running back Nick Benito, the second-year man with the tackle. Wilson is five for five today. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Audible here. Saw the uh, tight end. Uh, or the whatever. Come on. That should have been a pick. Xavier McKinney, you need to be embarrassed. That should have been a pick. That play could have been a lot worse. I saw nobody was guarding uh, one of the receivers. I think it was actually their tight end. Who is not on the line and nobody was on him so that could that play could have been a lot worse than what it was third and ten they could definitely hit a field goal from here though and they're gonna get the first down with the are you kidding me huh 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 how does that work okay that was annoying uh cole beasley gets lucky there is the definition of yards after and the Jets are back on top and the receiver does the rest seems so harmless doesn't it I do want to try to score because we have the ball after half the boy gets dangerous in the hands of the right receiver as he makes a move all right we're gonna try to score get the ball back and um get ourselves hopefully a two score or a one score lead uh we can finally lead in this one. <laughs> Renfro on for the return. And that was a good return for Hunter Renfro. Had he broken the tackle there, that could have been a uh, big return. All right. We got a minute 16 on the clock. I'm going to put Gilmore on a post here. Alright, go out of bounds. I, I'm hoping he got out of bounds there. Alright, looks like our main point of attack in this one is going to have to be in the air. Uh, I, I'm just feeling that today. That's, that's what's going to get us to win this Super Bowl. Um, oh, crap, crap. Down to his left. Oh, Baker taking ankles. We're gonna slide, and it's a first down run for Baker Mayfield. I don't know how that worked, but we took some ankles on the play. We still have time in this one, so I don't think we we need to resort to the um timeouts just yet. That. All right, that'll get Baker his X Factor too. And he's gonna get this inside the 30. So he cannot be intercepted by AI defenders now. That's his X Factor ability. Oh, Saquon! All right, we got nine seconds left. I want to score here. Um. Uh, okay, this is what I'm gonna do. Oh shit! No, no. Cause I was thinking about that, but I think that really only works in NCAA, so I'm not gonna try it. All right, we got nine seconds. Two plays probably. Just go up for it, CD. Our whoa, CD had it in his hands. I think the 43 yarders are best shot here. I think we, you know, we tried a little too much there. But Burkett. Knock down a, a field goal, that'll end the half, and we're going to have the ball back, and we're going to try to take a three-point lead um, after this next drive. And it's 10-14, uh, it's we're down right now. The Jets are being a pain in the butt today. Uh, and, you know, it was a slow first half for us. You know, we only got... We only got two drives in the first half. Wow. Uh, right? Of this Super Bowl in just a moment.
It's been a tremendous season. Man, that should not have happened right there. That should not have happened. One half of football to decide who oh, gosh. And for the Come on. Game, let's get it right back to Brandon and Charles. Okay, coach. Yeah, adjustments. We cannot let the Jets win this thing. We're down by four. I don't want to return that. We're down by four. And uh, we don't want a field goal on this drive. We want the touchdown. We want six and then the PAT to make it seven. trail here in the Super Bowl, but fortunately for them, Charles, very much still within striking range. Right. Can't get the ball on the ground that well with Barkley today. It's been a struggle. This Jets defense isn't even that good, so it's kind of embarrassing. But, um... Oh, we got the first down there, though. Barkley had a pretty good run. Uh, about 12, I believe, there. That one definitely helps as they try to push the ball down the field here, trailing early in the third quarter. And even though they're trailing, not abandoning the running right, Mayfield with the snap. Are you kidding me? Pick the ball up, Saquon. Saquon makes a good recovery, and we're going to get positive yardage off of that, making it a first down. So Mayfield fumbles the ball, Barkley picks it up, and he'll run it for the first down. So uh, that was... Uh, to lose the possession. That was, the word, you know, that was scary, but Mayfield capitalized. Um, but the opportunity for the defense was to go ahead and really close Or not Mayfield, Barkley capitalized. Broken tackle for Sabat. Blah, I can't speak. From Stephon Gilmore. Doing 70% in this one with Baker. Um, Alright. The second half, we are looking for improvement. That's, that's what we need in the second half. Improvement. Eric Ebron's gonna push for the first down. We're moving the ball up fields. Stephon Diggs is tired. That's great. We still got weapons though. We still got weapons. Oh no. Okay, Gil not Gilmore. <laughs> uh, Ebron holds on to it there, and it's first and goal for Mayfield. Lone man in the backfield, the snap. And Mims is going to score in this one. It's his second touchdown in the Super Bowl. And uh, we are on top for the first time today. And uh, hopefully we can keep it that way and our defense steps up. Because right now the defense, they've, 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 they haven't played great in this one. Burkich, it's up. It's good. 17-14 NYG. Here we go. Burkett, you're gonna get it back underway. Three-point lead. If we're gonna, if they're gonna score, let's try to hold them to a, uh, to a um, field goal on this drive. If they score, that's the most we want to allow. I'm hoping the defense, after a rough first half, though, can get it going in the second half. It's gonna be a pass one man in the backfield, and they still keep. This is ridiculous. Still the same in what they plan to do on offense. Here's second and a yard. Second and one for the Jets. Wilson. Snaps. Oh, we almost got the sack. Tackle from James Bradbury. Dang it, man. We were we were close there. We got we need to keep doing that. Bringing pressure to Zach Wilson. And uh, maybe it can force some bad throws in this one. Oh, you gotta lay the hit a little er earlier than that. All right, second and five. Wilson's lone man in the backfield. We're switching the play. Are you gonna get across the field? Oh, are you kidding me? We're getting eaten up right now. This should not be happening. Better coverage, that's what we need right now. Okay, I may have doubted the Jets. Right now, they're whooping our butts. Here 
This is Gaskin on the Nearing the end of the third quarter, Leonard Williams with the tackle. He is, uh, he, I don't think he's played too well. And uh, that's the end of the third. One more quarter in the season. And uh, it's Jets 14, Giants 17. I'm going back to cover two, man. I just don't trust it. Danny Shelton, if there's any time you could be playing well this season, it's in this game. You've played horrible this year. I don't want to lose a game to the Jets, please. I know, it? Uh, I gotta go back to the cover two, man. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? All right. We need a touchdown on this show. Unless, I mean, I want the touchdown. But if we could block a field goal here, that'd be big. All right. Four-point game with 526 left. I'm going to try to burn time off the clock. And uh, I'm not going to go for two. I'm not... <laughs> You know, we could make it to the point where they have to score a touchdown to win the game. But I don't want to do that and then we mess up big time. And they kick a field goal in the game. So, I don't I don't want to do that. I'm going to run the ball a little bit here, though. Ready to begin their next drive. Yeah, we're at the time of the Super Bowl where, look, they need points. Oh, my gosh, of course. That's the worst time for this stupid glitch to happen. <sighs> we need to score on this drive because our defense is just, no, it's not working for us today. Their defense just picked today to not show up out of all the games this season. Good job uh, pushing the ball across the line. That'll get Baker with his X-Factor now. Cannot be picked off by AI defenders. I'm hoping we block well. We could probably get it downfield to Stephon Gilmore. That's exactly what we're going to be able to do. And he's in the end zone. I said Stephon Gilmore, didn't I? Stephon Diggs. That leaves us plenty of time. So if the Jets are to score, that can, that'll that leave us a good amount of time to... Um, if they happen to score, get a field goal or something, we, we have some time to attack. Um, Baker Mayfield. We found we found Diggs. I mean, I'm so glad I switched up his superstar abilities because, you know, we switched that one superstar ability where we can hot, or hot route him to a post. And, uh, you know, that could be a big factor in this one of why why we win. If we do win. We don't know if we're going to win yet. I hope we do win. Uh, if we lose this game, you know, somebody is not going to be very happy. Um, are you freaking kidding me? All right, Blake Martinez. With the tackle there. We got to play better defense, man. That's the story of the game. If we want to win this thing, the defense has to be present. Those safeties need to be in. Oh, that could have been a pick. That could have been a pick. That, oh, that could have sealed the deal. Uh, Bradbury's got the X Factor. Please throw his way, Zach. Please. Third and five. We have not stopped them once on third down today, and we do it. Finally, we do it. And uh, they're going to punt it here. So this could come back to bite them in the butt. There's still a good amount of time, but we could uh, pull out front now. Oh, no, we're going to get a flag here. I sounded Australian for a second. I saw that. I saw that happen. We're going to get a flag. Are you kidding me? Thankfully, we're still going to have the ball. But, uh, boy, that... Mm, dang, man. All right, we have a three-point lead in Super Bowl 58. Dang, we just cannot get the ball on the ground with Saquon today. It's not working out. You know, we are struggling to use Saquon today. 
Get a good run there, though, and it's third and one. Just trying to get time off the clock, man. That's 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 our that's our aim right now. Get time off the clock. Um, we'll probably have possession by the two-minute warning unless we score, which I don't I don't think we're going to because I'm not going to try to score. I'm going to try to get this thing to the two-minute warning, and then we're gonna. Um, They'll try to run for it with Barkley. Yeah, he is gonna the end zone the after that. that Alright, Barkley's right starting to get the ball on the ground a little better. I'm just gonna let it run to the two minute warning here, and uh... We have a three point lead going into the two minute warning. Looking for the seventh Super Bowl in team history. I don't even know how many the Jets have right now, so... Yeah. So it's Giants football here as we welcome you back. All right, two they minutes left in the season. Going to run it with Barkley again. Barkley's going to push forward for a few yards. And now, two. here we go. And We're and just going to try to burn off the Jets' break. timeouts. Timeout and uh, with a minute 56 to go. So hopefully be able to take the win. Down, and they can get another run like we just saw. We'll likely put an end to this thing. They'll try and run some clock here. Oh, Saquon's going to get a good run now. How many yards does Baker have? Hold on, let me check and check here. Uh, 217 with three touchdowns. That sounds like a pretty good day playing quarterback to me. Barkley's about to get X-Factor now. Break the tackle, dang it. The Jets going to go ahead and use their final timeout. As he'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. And uh, now, Jets can't really stop the stop the clock. They'll try to right side here. Barkley only able to No timeouts to the left. After the nice broken tackle. Three yards is half of what they needed. Now can they get the other three here on third down? Mayfield to throw. Need the blocks here. And uh, I think CD got it across. Let's see. Yep, he does. It's over. We have it in our palm. Super Bowl's in the palm of our hands. We have a three point lead. And we can just kneel it down. One more play and uh, that'll do it. That is likely the final play of this game, and no better feeling I would imagine than taking a knee to wrap up the Super Bowl. Culminates everything. The championship is theirs, and just think the last. I throw this one to Stephon Diggs, and that'll do it pretty much. Doing this, practicing taking a knee and winning a Super Bowl. And they get to do. And we're gonna get it done by three. Clock is ticking down. They'll try and run for it with Barkley. And uh, that's Take it. That's the final play. Run with Saquon. And we're going to win Super Bowl 58 by 3 over the New York Jets. And uh, not going for it on third and five really does come to bite him in the butt. And to the Super Bowl champions, they etch their name forever in NFL immortality. That felt like a really quick game. I don't know why. Joe Judge. Zach Wilson. Yeah, I know. Y'all suck. No, they put up a good fight. We could have won that by more, but I was just really trying to run the clock down. What a game, man. Here's some of the highlights. There's our first touchdown in this one. We're just going to look at ours, apparently. There was the one that gave us the lead. Uh, there was that one to Cole Beasley. I think Beasley had two in this one, yeah. There was the first, or that's the first one. They just showed the other one. Um, and there's confetti on the field. We're just looking at the end zone. And confetti. Baker Mayfield gets uh, Super Bowl MVP. 231 yards, three touchdowns, and 82.4. Uh, completion percentage with Jonah Williams right there. Well, that's it. That is season number three, guys, and uh, we have the offseason up next.
And uh, Stefan Diggs with his first season in the team is going to get his first Super Bowl. Hands it off to Blake Martinez, who gets his third. Um, Baker gets his second. Saquon also gets his third. It was, uh, it was a good season, man. It was a good season, you know. We had a great season. Well, that's a wrap on the 2022 season. No, uh, 2023 season, I believe. Uh, we were trailing for a bit in this one, but, you know, we took it in the, uh, the third. And they may have battled back in the fourth, but, uh, you know, we are able to win the Super Bowl three by three. That'll do it for this one, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.